吉村田の吉村さんから直接伝授されたお店だそうです。It seems that this shop was directly taught by Mr. Yoshimura of the Yoshimura family. こちらのお店は自動系ラーメンと家系ラーメンが食べれるお店です。This is a restaurant where you can eat Jira style ramen and a K ramen. I ordered the Jiro type. It's Jiro type but tastes similar to large ramen. The noodles are thick and have a strong and delicious taste. It's pork bone soy sauce, but it Doesn't have any unpleasant taste. The soup is well balanced and delicious. It's a shame that I can't grow more vegetables. The vegetables are crunchy and delicious. The vegetables are crunchy and the soup is delicious. ここのお店は替え玉ができます。自動系は細麺しかできませんが、家系は細麺、中麺、太麺の替え玉ができます。You can get kedama at this shop. Jiro K can only make thin noodles, but EKK can also make thin, medium, and thick noodles. 卵丼は180円で食べれる。You can eat egg bowl for 180 yen. スープの温度はちゃんと熱い、冷めにくいスープでした。最後まで美味しく食べれました。The temperature of the soup is really hot. The soup didn't get cold easily. It was delicious till the end. かけを食べましたが、なんかさっぱりした感じでした。I ate EK, but it felt refreshing. かっぱ寿司で吉村か監修食べたとき、夫婦で感動したくらい美味しかったのですが、今回はなんか、はてな。When I ate it at Kappa Sushi Under, the supervision of the Yoshimura family, my husband and I were so impressed by how delicious it was, but this time we had something, Hitina. スープが薄い感じがしました。本家は食べたことないから何とも言えませんが、玉木に家は食べたことあるので、そこに比べるとちょっと薄く感じました。The soup seemed thin, I can't say. Anything about honk because I haven't eaten it, but I have eaten congea. So I felt it was a little thin compared to there. EK was a little thin, but the balance with the noodles was really good and it was delicious. When I ate Kangia, I remember that it was rich but well balanced and that there was a very handsome man there. Also, there is commercial grade grated garlic on the table. So if you don't have enough garlic, you can add it. This is a mopping video up to the rice check. Some reviews say that the staff's attitude is terrible. There was no such strange attitude. コメントで子供やお客様の声がうるさい人し書いてるコメントが多すぎます。子供はうるさいのは親のしつけだから、最近このような理由のわからないコメントが多すぎ。There are too many comments saying that the voices of children and customers are too loud. Children are noisy because their parents discipline them lately. There have been so many comments like this that I don't understand why.
赤ちゃんは泣くのが仕事だしね理由のわからないことで星位置をつけてる人が最近多すぎる悲しい世の中になってきたなって口コミ見ていて思う今日この頃です It's a baby's job to cry after all these days <笑> As I read reviews, I think we've become a sad world with too many people giving one stars for reasons they don't understand. <laughs> As mentioned in the reviews, it may be weak for Jiro type unless it is dark. As a K-Ramen, I think it's a little thin and has a similar taste to ramen shop style noodles as mentioned in the reviews. As a result, it is recommended for those who prefer a lighter taste than the original Jiro type. It might be a hit for people who like things without punch. If you go expecting Yoshimuroya, it will be thin and a little sour, so it might be a good idea to go for a different type of food. If you like ramen and don't like punch, it might suit you. 多分若者向けではないので最近二郎系家系がきつい方にはめちゃくちゃ合うと思います It's probably not for young people but I think it's perfect for people who have a strict Jiro lineage these days 皆様の感想も聞かしてね Let me know what you think ここからはモッパン動画です Here's a mopping video
円。small rice 100 yen。少し臭みがあり、粉粒が小さい安いこだわりのない、ベーです。it's a cheap, unpretentious rice。with a little smell and small grains。そのまま食べるとすごくまずくはむ胃が毎日家庭で出されたら発狂するかも。It doesn't taste too bad if you eat it as is, but if you serve it at home every day, you might go crazy. スープにかけたら臭みが消えて食べれるので安心した。I was relieved that when I poured it on the soup, the smell disappeared and I was able to eat it. 横に厚木草津温泉センターが。スーパー銭湯がアリサウナの温度が女性が100近く男性は100度超えでセルフロウリュができるサウナがあるので最近のお気に入りです The Atsugi Kusatsu Onsen Center has a super public bath next to it and the temperature of the sauna is close to 100 degrees for women and it's over 100 degrees for men so it's my new favorite as it has a sauna where you can self flow 厚木はラーメン屋が多いのでまたちょくちょく探索しようかなって思います。There are a lot of ramen restaurants in Atsugi, so I thought I'd check it out again. I think so. ご視聴いただきありがとうございましたチャンネル登録、高評価、コメントいただけるととってもとっても励みになりますそしてあなたのおすすめなお店をコメント欄で教えていただけたと嬉しいですではよろしくお願いいたしますチャンネル登録してねバイバイまた